Hello everyone, it is I, Snicklefritz, and today we are going to be playing some Darkwood. Now this video, I guess you could say, is pretty much sponsored by my buddy Mike, because he's the one who bought this for me. He has been telling me about how good of a game it is, and how much he loved, loved it, or is loving it, and he really wanted me to try, and I trust my man's uh, taste in games, because ever since I've known him since high school, he's... If never stirred me really wrong on any games that I have played that he's told me to. So we are going to be diving into this today. I hope you guys are excited about it as I am. And with all that being said, thank you so much for stopping by the channel. It is super, super appreciated that you're coming and stop by the channel for this quick 15, 20 minute video of Darkwood. I know you could be anywhere else, but yet you're choosing to spend it with me. And I thank you from the bottom of my heart. It meets everything to this guy. Uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and look at this stuff. We're going to keep it down. Everything the same of how it is. This Indiegogo content, I'm really kind of curious to what the immersion breaking content is. But hey, if that is the default setting, that's what we're going to do. So let's do that. You are playing a challenging and unforgiving game. You will not be led by the hand. Respect the woods. Be patient. Focus. Well, okay then. If that ain't ominous, I don't know what it is. He's a prologue. I see hatred and fear in their eyes. As if I was responsible for the spreading disease. As if I were the source of all the misery plaguing the land. I have nowhere to hide from them, nowhere to run. The woods have closed us off from the outside world. We are all doomed. Well, that was short and sweet and to the point. We're doomed, ladies and gentlemen. We're doomed. Welcome inside the wonderful world of dark wood. I uh, hope you guys are, like I said, excited to check this out with me. Uh, and once again, if you do like what you see going on in this video as we go, make sure you hit the little like button and leave the comments down below. Thank Mike for sitting there and hooking me up with this game for us to play on this channel. Now, where he did buy this for me, this is going to be a full series. I know I've said that many times before, but I've also said before, if any of my subscribers or viewers would like to see a certain series on the channel, all you have to do is tell me. And if I'm able to play it, it will be played on here now. He made the extra effort to actually buy this game for me. So since he went that extra mile, it, it's definitely going to be a series that is going to be popping up at least, I mean, a video at least once a week for this series because, you know, he's a great person and he hooked me up with something that he didn't have to. And he's a great friend and I love him like a brother. So that is why you could definitely be seeing this as a series. Now, I'm not saying you have to buy me games for it to turn into a series. But say I have a game and you would like to see it, such as, I know this is old as hell, but Fallout 3. I can play Fallout 3 for you. I own that. And I will make it a whole series, even if it's just one person that wants to see it. That's how much you guys matter to me. You're not just a number to help the channel grow, to help the my channel grow. Because like I said, it's not just mine. I may be the one running it and putting the videos out for it. But you guys, once again, are the heart and soul all 30 of you welcome number 30 to the to the channel welcome to the community uh i wish i had your name i throw a nice little card on here with little you know music playing welcome you to the community but this is the best i could do for you so thank you so much for stopping by and uh liking the channel enough to join us over here in geek Tom. so from me and the other 29 community members just welcome welcome I know these notes by heart. 
I do not want to read them now. Okay, well, you don't have to, brother. An alcohol distiller? A homemade device for producing moonshine. Ooh, I don't think you need to be drinking, bro. <laughs> you can drag. Oh. Now that's cool. It actually gives you the noise. I search the table. Ooh, we got some pills. And a note pad. I'm gonna wait. I don't know if I need none of this stuff. The only edible thing in the land. And I still have some left. Some old potatoes. The generator is almost out of juice. I need to find a full gasoline can. I saw a broken tractor to the east. Maybe I could find some gasoline there. Now I will say, I do love just already this little bit of time i love the ambient noises to this like the, ch the sliding of the chair that squeaking of that door it already is like makes me feel like there's gonna be a lot of noises that's gonna be creeping me out just noises and that itself is just a plus to to me okay nothing in my shoes got a cage what's in the cage Cage. MTA. Okay. What's this? Oh, it's a chair. And we can search in a chair. So in my little wooden chair, I have a camera, a medicine bag, and a photo. Okay. Kind of weird. Maybe it's like a fluffy chair that has pockets. You hear that? Fuck. What's that outside? Is that a dead person? I don't know. Maybe it's just like a tree hitting the house or something. Now it's empty. Let's go in this metal door. I would rather not open it. I spent too much time locking him in there. So there's somebody beating on the other side of this door? Hell. Uh, okay, that opens at least. What the world is on the floor? Potatoes? Are those potatoes as well? The lock has jammed a long time ago. Never mind. I used to keep useless junk in there anyway. Okay, so can't do nothing there. Got a door locked, uh, somebody else locked up in some place. You can only interact with objects that's within your reach. The interaction range is indicated by the color changing around the prompt. Okay, like, basically, the A in exam is gray. Okay, now I can use it. I just woke up. Well, thank you. I, I did not know, because, you, you know, I thought you were sleepwalking. Uh. Okay. Uh, the radio has been silent for years, although I think sometimes I can hear voices through the static. Hmm. Okie dokie. Artichoke. Uh, some more notes, known by heart. Uh, I best not enter this room right now. Why can I not go in these two rooms? At least it didn't say he locked somebody in that one. I feel a little bit more safe. Uh, quickly produced moonshine. Barely filtered. So we got alcohol, board, a matchstick, medical book, ooh, a key. I'll, well, just according to that little thing, I'll open the front door to my house with this. I'm thinking we might need it, so I am going to grab that. Uh, rags. Hey, we can make a Molotov cocktail, it seems like, with the matchsticks and stuff. Uh, you know what? Transfer all? Yeah, that's the one. I'm going to take those. So I'm thinking maybe a Molotov cocktail in the board might be some type of weapon I could smack people with, just in case. Let's do that. Let's let's use the same tied-out word that all these people are saying nowadays. I don't, I don't know why. It's not like I get triggered by it, but I really hate... Oh, let's do that big brain move, or oh, let me do my... 500 IQ move. It's so played out. It's like an overused joke to me. Ooh. 
Hey. <laughs> uh, locked. Yep, told you. Locked. Why to do other... Okay. So we can barricade it, use the key, and open. Fantastic. Let's open. To the outside world. Let's take our first step. <gasps> no! Oh! Poor puppy! And it's mine. I don't think he's going to make it. I should end his suffering. Okay, one. If this was me, if this was really Fritz, his dog would not be outside with its ribs missing and bleeding. Oh, my, Mike! What are you doing? What are you doing to my poor heart? Oh, my God. What name was sweet baby Jesus? Look at this. I mean, so I could probably get here. But I got cages in the way, right? Oh, man. Can, how do I... Let me check stuff. Oh, it's a wooden doll. Thank God. A large humanoid dog with a face carved out. Uh... Is you... Oh, yeah. It used to be a luxury, but since all the road access has been devoured by the woods, it's become a useless pile of trash. The People's Tribute to the Daily Newspaper of the Polish People's Republic. Oh, okay. We're in Poland. Uh, well. Ah, let's take the rope. How do I... How do I put this dog out of his misery? Paul, no. No. Okay, uh... Can I put it there? No. Oh, I gotta get away from that. It's like really hurt my feelings to hear that. I'm sorry I can't... I know that's really weird to say. I'm sorry I can't beat your face in with this board to kill you and put you out your misery. Ugh. At least I don't hit... Oh... Okay. Will that work now? Okie dokie. I do not know how to do that. Don't know how to do that either. I don't have the skills to use yet. <gasps> um. Okay. Oh. I'm so sorry, dogs, and everybody else is an animal lover. I'm so sorry. Ah. I'm so sorry. I just died a little bit inside. I just died. Just a teeny bit. Ah. Yeah, I don't really know how to do it. Stupid piece of wood. Ooh, that shit was loud. Uh, bear trap? Examine. Snare trap, so must be careful. The woods are full of them. Ah, oh, I can do something with Y. What's this? Pick up and examine. Yeah, well, I could have just picked it up without doing that. I did cow. Uh, sure. I'll take the bone. Now, I wonder if I could use that bear trap to hurt monsters and stuff, because... <laughs> One would think there's monsters in this game. Or I would, anyway. But what kind of person am I already? Because I'm getting bad vibes of who you're playing as. Okay. Oh, okay, that, that's not me. I am here. Okay. But the woods have devoured all the roads that connect us to the outside world no one is able to pass through this thicket but yeah back like to what I'm saying okay he's, he's got somebody locked up into his room he's totally neglected his dog to the point of having to kill it the damn thing what in the world 
What's going on with this human being? Oh shit! Hey, I. How long has the music been playing? Did it just start? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. Definitely not connected to this this guy here. He really makes me very sad. The person I'm playing. So if he dies, I won't care too much when I die. Well, would you look at that? I could have just left all those boards, matchsticks, and 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 stuff there. Well, all right, but I'll take it though. Ooh, only got four slots left. I need to be careful. Excuse me. These parts of the woods are dark. I should craft a torch. Okay. Oh. Cool. So if anybody's playing, you don't need to grab all, all that stuff out there like I did. You could just grab yourself the, the alcohol. And then everything else will be fine. Or you can substitute the alcohol for your gasoline. Okay, but it only uses 0.3 of the gasoline and one full. Okay, I gotcha. Oh, nice. It gives you back the bottle. That is cool. Right? Yeah, empty bottle. I like you. So let's put that there. Let's keep walking. It doesn't look any brighter. So I gotta okay you gotta equip it of course they wouldn't want you to walk around with light in and axe at the same time <laughs> okay uh let's I guess hop this fence let's check that house I can go down here no an abandoned house okay I wonder how long the torch is going to last. What was that? Was that me? Was that me? He's okay, that has to be me. God, I hope it's me. <laughs> uh. Get away from here, creepy guys. Oh, damn. We got a dead deer over there and a corpse in a tree. In a few days, it will be completely absorbed. Okay. You weird tree. Can I can I check stuff out here? I'll take the rags, I guess. From rags to riches, baby. <laughs> Some more rags. A uh, doorway. I don't really repair no doorway. If this is a busted up house, I'm not fixing it. So. Look at this weird ass. D Wait a minute. That looks like human feet in a human butt crack. In the upper half of a deer. Was some weird sick person try to doctor up a deer and a human being together? That's weird. Very weird. Wait a minute, doctor? Ain't I a doctor? I'm telling you, right now, this guy is something weird about him. I don't know if it was him that... I wasn't moving that time. Was not moving that time. Unless there's lag going from the game to my headphones. I don't think... Another one? I'll take the, take the rags. It's fine. Look at this. Now it looks like a, maybe a doe and more human legs what in the name of baby Jesus is going on so this might be a little bit longer than 15 20 minutes you can enter far look by holding ZR and using the right stick to move the cursor all of the on-screen prints will be hidden so you can explore the world 
Oh, okay. So it just gives you that little bit of extra imp forward, if you will. Can I can I take this off? Okay, at least it's brighter this way. Cool. Cool, cool. Let's see here. Ooh. Yeah. What? You watch yourself, sucker. I think this one is still breathing. Alright. What's going on here first? Let's check to see if we can get... I want to look around before I talk to him. Because I'm afraid that if I... Go mess around with him, I might die. I'm telling you, these sounds are just good. All right, fella. You look injured. You're unconscious. Are you all right? You better not fuck with me. It's like I'm just messing with you. Ah, uh, big metal key. If there is an exit out to these woods, I mean, exit out of these woods, this key will surely open it. Now, what I, what I got a question is, if I remember the story already, the woods have overgrown. So unless while these woods took over and overgrown the whole area all around it and made a keyhole i don't think this is how that you get out the woods i'd put use this axe and just chop down some trees and poof gone 21 okay huh okay cutscene glad, uh, glad i did look around he's unconscious i've never seen him around here before He's only carrying a key and some journal. Since he's managed to sneak in here, he must know how to get out. Of course, he won't help me voluntarily. What? Whoa. What? But that... is of no importance. Okay. I have got to be the worst human being trapped in this woods. I've already locked one person up, and now I'm about to torture somebody, it seems. I need to get out of this cursed fortress. For, for, forest? What? You hear me, rat? Yes, look at him. He's torturing him. What is he doing to him? Show me how, and I will let you go. What in the hell? Sometimes I hear her voice. She's calling me. Calling me to return home. Where is the exit? Where? Poor guy. Show me where. Oh, God damn. Yeah, it's official. I'm a dick. Good God! I'll kill you like a dog if I... Oh, that's fucked up. You don't deserve a dog. You piece of shit. Oh, great. You're about to come back here and torture this poor guy? The fucker stole my key. Wait a minute. Uh. Huh? <laughs> oh man. Um. Whoa. So. I take it I'm not the psycho no more, and I'm, I'm the poor guy he kidnapped. <laughs> um. I think we might just call it quits for right now. Uh, and we'll, we'll, we'll pick up uh, on the next video. I probably will record a little bit more and have the next one set up and ready to go. But so far this story is kind of a mindfuck right now. I thought it was just a dark day that it turns out I now I've kidnapped two people. I don't care about my animal and killed it. And then made reference to killing him like I killed that animal. 
just found a this oh man my, the, the main character you start off with that doctor he's a prick that's all i got to say that's messed up uh so make sure if you <laughs> do you like this crazy story so far to hit that little like button down below and if you are new to the channel and would like to be part of this lovely community over here at Geekdom, hit that subscribe button as well and if you do care to be notified when videos do hit the channel feel free to hit that little bell icon as well without that being said i shall let you guys go thank you once again for stopping by the channel spending some time with me over here at Geekdom. i am snuckle fritz and as always you guys stay classy